Right, hello everyone, we're back um, in Liberty City and we're here with the Firefighter mod. Um, so, this is the, El well, the Liberty City Ambulance Service. And uh, we're just waiting for a call out. No, oh, actually, I better make sure I'm not busy. What's the button? F6. Ah, okay, yeah, right, that's fine. So, what we are gonna need to do, because I don't have much fuel left in this thing. We will head towards. Calculating route. Uh, no, okay, we won't get time. Announcing a medical run. Medic Right, okay, so let's head along to that. Right. Okay. Um, so we're along here. Um, so we're in here somewhere. Ah, there they are. You have arrived. Okay, so um, let's get let's get going. So we'll go out and see to this person. Uh, whoops. Check for vitals. He's in critical condition, so we will start treatment, which is four. You're now treating the patient, so it's kind of standing, but uh, yeah. So not too bad. We will um, we'll need to go and get the stretcher out. So um, we will go in. We'll need to go in here. We'll need to lower the ramp. Uh, so car options and it's open trunk, I think. Nope, that's the wrong one. Uh, open hood. Yes, there we go. So that lowers the ramp. So let's close the trunk. The victim must be inside the ambulance. I know, I know. We need to get the stretcher out first. Okay, so now we can open the back, which is... Oh, okay. We'll go out, and uh, we will put him back in the ambulance. Um, Medic 70 to Manhattan. Patient is ready for transport. So we'll see what they say. Manhattan to Medic 70. Roger. Take the patient to Alderney Hospital Center. Okay, so they want us to take it to take him to Alderney. So that'll be a relatively quick drive. So. They're stable enough. So let's go. Oh, there's a military police car. Slow down a bit, there's no one else coming. Uh, green lights. So they're stopping to let us through the middle. 800 yards. Green lights again. Right. I really don't have that much fuel left in this thing. I think uh, after this we're going to have to um, put ourselves to unavailable and stop off at a petrol station somewhere. To make ourselves heard. Yes, yes, that's our warning to let us know that we don't have much fuel left. In 200 yards, turn left. Um, I don't even know where the... Oh, no, the, I think there's a petrol station near the hospital, I think. Um, ah, we've gone the wrong way, I forget you don't follow the GPS, because it leads you a stupid windy road. 
basically. Even even the AI can't handle it properly, let alone this bus. You have arrived. Okay, so here's the hospital. So we're just going to um turn around and get the patient in. Whoops. Okay, so same again. Let us uh, put down the patient ramp. You must be close to the rear doors of the ambulance. Yeah, I know, I know. I'm just putting down, putting down the ramp, and then we'll get get the guy out. Now, what is it? Is it T? No, T gets equipment. Is it O? Yes. Okay, so we now have our patient, so we'll go up the ramp. We'll need to move this little nurse out the way, thank you very much. And this nurse, sorry, sorry, sorry. <laughs> okay, so we're going to go ahead and check this person into... Just wheel him around and check into the nurse. So they're going to tell us to take him to the recovery room. And here is the recovery room. Okay, so we've now handed over the patient to the hospital staff. Um, why have we still got the patient? Uh, okay. It, uh, it seems something borked a wee bit. So yes, we are just going to sign out. And that will be us done. <laughs> I don't know how to get rid of the guy in this dredger. Anyway, thank you very much for watching this quick video. And I'll see you next time. Bye.